Yo, squad dream was popping. We at the hex table, cause you know what time it is. It's time for transit information. And today's episode is the rehash of last year. Check this one out though. It's good to be back on uh, my um, spectrums and parents and stuff like that. Parents especially, you guys need to pay close attention to this because this is the crooked, this is the crooked school for you fools. You know what I'm saying? They got these new school rules. But see, on the notebook it says I, you know, exceed. You know, I exceed my own abilities to thwart shit like this. So let's get into last year. Remember I told you guys they were going to say, hey, yeah, we want you, um, we want your children to talk to you through, you know, these dumb devices and my, my day and stuff. It's like, wait a second. An email or something on your yeah. phone. So you, what do you do? You stare at a dumb screen all day. And talk to your child. When your child comes stare at your eyes and project the light back and forth because that's what you're supposed to do because you're supposed to pan that L from left to right. You know? and so as soon as they come home, you don't have nothing to talk about. So except you, for what's for dinner. Yeah, and that's it. That, is, that, that, that creates that's dissonance. That's not how life is. And that's not how it was back in the 60s, 70s, and 80s. And even before that. And, and, and that type of activity creates dissonance. In the household, dissonance of, or dis, dissonant activity. If you don't know what that word means, it's called unharmonic. You know, it's, it's chaotic. It's not like in harmony. It's the opposite of harmony. It would be the antonym of harmony. Okay? Now, I'm going to explain this shit clear. They wanted to push that stupid ass agenda into school on all children, not just my son, mm -hmm. but the idea of. That being proposed is so ludicrous and preposterous beyond belief. I can't get down with that because I say to myself, well, well, my, and creep crew. Yeah. I just, my, my creep. He's quiet though. Yeah. My, yeah. He was on. The town, town is going down. They, they, they see the crows are flying around now. Circling They're, around. Yeah. Baby. It's coming. It's coming. There you go. Right there, buddies. Crew. Buddies. Money creep coming. 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 Speak. Come spacing man. Oh, my pretty cool. To be sneaking. This shone, this shone, this shone. Come in, come in. Turn to Come in, up, um, Morgan Rod. Huh? Here, my bad. The birds, listen, my crows are coming to protect. They're flying around my window literally because they close. know. They know, boo, you see that? If it does it again, we're gonna take the camera and show it to you. I'm telling you that. There goes a leaf, a solo leaf just way in the sky, floating like a bird. That's crazy. All right, yep. let's get back on topic, man. Yes. You know, when you talk to, you know, when we come to this table, it's a whirlwind hex. You get perplexed and vexed and under the hex. You know? So, look, let's get it. Look. So, they wanted to cyborg the kids, right? Yeah. Basically, cyborg the parents. We already been cyborg. You know what I'm saying? Smartphones, TVs. Tablets, shit. Tablets, laptops. You know what I'm saying? Huh? Don't sit so close to the TV. Make something like a TV in the size of the palm. Maybe a little bit bigger in the size of a book. Because, you know, make tablets like this. Book's kind of uh, large uh, compared to the phone, the Yatsumashata. Right? Let's get real. I'm going to hit these motherfuckers with this, man. Western Merriam Deluxe Dictionary. College Edition. Underbridge. Ain't nothing short around here. Sweet. My So let's check this out. Cyborg their kids, right? That's what they want to do. Huh. You gonna send this paper home to me? Negatory and a letter back to the school and tell me why you guys sound like clinic retards. Guess what didn't happen? That dumbass uh, stuff that they said. The the dumb cyborg um, talk to your parents and stuff. No children is no child is yeah. doing that in that school. On my on my word. On my word. Oh, uh, because we told our son that that stuff was stupid. Clinically retarded. And he, so his, he went to school and told that to a few of his classmates. classmates spread and, like a virus. And it spread like a virus. Pre, they thought about it. Pre-crew. That makes this going that is way. stupid. And Keep they're going. like, yeah, it is. It's dumb. So what am I going to talk to my mom and my dad about when I get home? Oh, nothing, because I'll probably be thrown in front of a TV. A screen. I'm play a video game after I'm done with my homework. So you throw a kid in front of a screen, and then you throw him in front of another screen. Peep the demean. I already told you what this is. Peep my demeanor. See that? See the reflection of the camera? Scrying mirror. Get the fuck out of here. You can't tell me shit. Okay? What I do is I take the complex. 
I take the mystifier. I take the shit that makes people go ah and boo and why. And I break it down. Why and how? Here it goes. On the table. Broken down simple in its finest form. In its rawest form. In its little finest compound. A, B, C, one, two, three. That's how it should be done. Yes, the complex will perplex. Yes, the, comp the complex will vex your ass and hex your ass as well. Because if you know not, then you become confused. And if you know not of what you're up against, how can you fight it efficiently? You see? So these fools think that they can mess with this household again. So we're going to come back. Hmm. Interesting enough. We're going to come back again. Nebby neighbors, you know what they do. They get on a frequency. They got to listen. They're corny. I know what it is. That's why I said interesting enough. And yeah, they, yeah. because guess what? The, the, chick, the chick should be leaving and going to work, locking her door. She just went in, which means she's probably standing in front of our door. Hope you like what you hear. It's the truth. I know you hate it. You can't evade it. You know the shit's word related. You no, know I spit them rhymes. I do it every time. You guys be dropping dimes because you're snitches and your bitches. But guess what? St snitches get ditches. You know that. You know that. That's why you guys know better. That's why you won't come here. And when you come here, you're going to run out with your tail between your legs and your hair white and falling out like you got cancer. 100%. I'll vaporize your ass. So on back to the topic is they're starting their crap again this year. And this time, they're, it's just. They tried to set me up last year. It's about me. It's about me. They tried to say I did, I, they tried to say I did something to my son. And even his own mom knows that I didn't whack him and do all this crazy bullshit. Okay? And, but the school tried to do this, say this about me. They tried to say that I'm a negligent father. Yeah, right, dude. That's retarded. If I have an eBay store and I'm selling electronics on there, what do you think I'm using that money for? I'm selling rack units for $200, $300. Yeah, eBay gets their cut. They got to do that, right, boo? They got to get their cut, right? They have to get their money. All right. Their hey, piece of it, piece of the pie. I'm cool with that. They got, they breaking bread. They let me hustle legally on, on the store. My name's Trader Crow. Go to my stove. You'll see Mo and Mo, mainly for the blow fell. Cool, that's heavy. I, I can't even talk about that right now. I got some heavy stuff for you guys, man. Wait till I get on there. You're gonna be like, whoa, Gustavo. So they try, they try, they can one frame your boy again. But they hit, they hit the uh. So, okay, my my son. This is how this is how watered down the school is. My son tells another child that his handwriting is horrible. <laughs> 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 and like he can't read it, and I, th I find that's out funny. That's all he said. He didn't even say it in a mean, nasty way. Funny though. He just said, "I'm sorry, your handwriting sloppy, and I can't read it. Blue I can't understand it. it." So, the kid just really got a whole attitude, crying over a a cons what I consider constructive criticism. Yeah. Like, step he up your handwriting, baby. Mean. So, their parents must not be teaching their children constructive criticism. And that it's okay sometimes be told what you're doing wrong or right. Yeah, and in the manner of being told. I mean, if you're not, if you don't tell, like, if you're doing constructive criticism, you don't degrade a person while doing so. You do it within cordial manner. And do it as <laughs> a teaching element as well teach like Jason said that he told that child that if he would write slower it would be neater but my son's not that sophisticated right you know, he just said listen your handwriting's sloppy I can't read yeah. that shit I'm sorry and the kid but the kid starts crying though but that's what I'm saying but the, ch but the kid he says that too they start crying I'm thinking to myself like man come on dude how are you going to get upset about that? The geese, all the birds are coming around here. They, see, this is bird town, dude. I'm the, I'm the bird man, man. I told you, birds are the bird mediums, dude. Birds are filled with air and water. Their bones are hollow, all of them. 
even eagles. I know they seem like they're a lot more adorable, but man, you can snap their leg like a little hollow bamboo stick that's really small and skinny. Yeah. I'm telling you that. But their legs are also strong and flexible, but you can snap very easily, which is why when eagles get hurt, they come to humans that are kind on the 528 say, please help me fix my leg. Yeah, silently. I heard them when you were talking that little bit. That's why I said Blue Jay in the background and confirmed it. Oh. Oh, thanks, lady. I love you. <sighs> Sometimes it's good to get a hug from somebody, somebody you love. Uh, that's what I'm doing. My girl doesn't feel good. I'm trying to comfort her. Blah, blah, blah. You know? They try to destroy the household, though. They try to destroy it. You know what I'm saying? They did. They tried to destroy this household last year and split us up and blah, blah, blah and say, oh, yeah. Yeah, I don't know what the agenda is. That's what they want. They, everything is corrupted, dude. That's, that's all anybody corrupted. knows anymore is broken homes, single moms. Single dads. Single dads. Oh, dad. <laughs> Just life like that, all retarded. Or people that aren't even, you know, they don't have whole families anymore. Yeah. And, and everybody's okay with that. No, I'm not. I'm not. Listen, man. Look, the agenda. Listen, listen here, y'all. And all the women sit there at their dinner table or outside smoking with their coworkers, mm -hmm. talking about how bad life is and their baby's dad. Blah, 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 blah. Mm -hmm. And they, that's what they want. But let me tell you what it is, though. It's because of, okay, there's an agenda. It's called the feminist agenda, man. If you have too much feminine energy, what do you think happens? Things become off balance. It has to be yin and yang, man. There is no other way. There okay, has to be harmony. There has to be balance. Just right. like the double helix in DNA. Yeah, if no. it was RNA, it wouldn't have the double helix. Right. I'm not right. really Rilo trying to argue. Acid. There's an RNA. XY thing going on in nature. I'm not doing it. The agenda will be forwarded on my word. <laughs> Wanna play with me? You know my rap game. I'm not rapping right now cause I changed who I am. Now my name Lou Crow. L-U-C-R-O. You know my name. You know my game. I still throw the crow sign up. You know my gang. It's 33528. You join the gang now because you know the stupid shit's going on. Or you're going to expire of your own retardation and the sabotage of the corrupted one. Do you really want to sit back as a grown man or woman, work so hard to live your life and build up what you have to let someone else take it all from you? Is that what you guys really want? No, you, you gotta stand your ground. What the fuck? Why would you work all that? All that way and all that yeah. hard blood, sweat, and tears, man. Yeah, right? Who's spilling blood? Everybody that put their blood, sweat, and tears in their work. Don't necessarily gotta be blood on stuff. I know you guys like to say slick shit on Blowfield, uh, you little trolls. <laughs> it really is blood. Did people. you stab someone to get it? No, motherfucker. I told you I work with wood. I had to, I made the stand one time. I got cut doing it because sometimes I get splinters. You know, screws go through fast. I got a craftsman's drill. You see? I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a man, motherfucker. Men cut our fingers sometimes because we work hard, bitch. Yeah, that's called being a man. You got tons of fucking calluses on your hand. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's what I do. If I smack the shit out of one of you motherfuckers, you'll know that. I just had to check. I just had to check. A, I just had to check a stupid ass bitch ass dude yesterday in Aldi's that tried to say some slick shit to my girl when she worked at her old job. Yep. Fucking dude, try to be tough. He, he you could tell he's a woman beater. You know what I'm saying? A real woman beater. I don't do shit like that. Trying to mack on me while I was at the job, but still had a girlfriend. And then look at look at look at his, look at dude's mom walking down the street taking selfies. In the was mad. Was mad. Look at his mom. Look, was look, mad because I wasn't giving him the time of day, so he said some slick shit about. You see her go down the street. That. You see her holding her phone up, taking selfies, walking down the street. That's how fucking vainglorious people are, and they ain't even they don't even look good. Don't trip. Stop. Come on. <laughs> Come on, girl. Okay. I don't, I don't feel like watching somebody roll down the hill and bust in their head that I'm a witness to that. I'm like, man, this all I know. And I'll tell the police and the ambulance people. You know what they were doing? Taking, Taking a selfie. selfie. Oops. Not paying attention to the road. 
slipping on leaves. Just like down here the other day. Oh, I'm not the other day. About a year ago, the lady was walking right down there. Where they're coming up the street, they don't have to stop coming up the street by the Boys and Girls Club. Yeah. This lady is paying, not got her headphones on, got her head up. Ooh, hold the, hold down. Down walking on the thing almost gets hit by the car because she's not paying attention. See what I mean? Zombie on bipedal I'm maggot. Like, Bipedal maggot on two feet what? walking. Every zombie. time, every time something dumb like that happens, I happen to be by it. Why? Because I need to be a fucking witness to. It. Yeah. Oh, there you go. And then, did you see what happened? Yeah, they were on the dumb shit, staring at their freaking phone. Yeah, got right. the headphones in, got the hip hood up, on knowing that that street going up is a they they don't stop and they can't see coming up that hill. Right. And then that's what happens though. If you live around here, you know that street. And you know people, ca the cars don't stop. So if you're walking around around here, you either just moved here and you're trying to figure out the situation of the city. Yeah. You didn't know it. Or you've lived here for a while and you hold know up. all the stupid streets. Hold up, hold up, hold up. We're getting off topic though. We're supposed to be dropping. Hold up. We're supposed to be dropping why I think I'm afraid of No, down. no, we're getting back to I'm just saying that's how dumb people I, are. I gotta get WD-40 for that squeaky-ass window. Spray it. I am. I'm about to. That's just annoying. Every time you open it up, it, like, puts you on full blast. and make birds even turn their heads. Like, damn, what the hell are you doing? I'm just opening a window. I know y'all heard that. Listen, this is how noisy this thing is. That's the window. Oh, uh, now it's not doing it. Now I don't want to do it. I'm trying to put it on display. That's funny. I know y'all heard it when Funny. I moved it. I know y'all heard it just a minute ago, that squeaking noise. That was the window. I know you're yeah, probably yeah. like, what was that? We'll play it back and we'll hear. Yeah. yeah. Run it back a couple seconds. Run something. it back. But listen, the real topic is, okay, so he tells the kid, can't read your handwriting, man. It's just sloppy. Sorry. So this kid crying. Blah, blah, blah. Mine and my son going to say... He want to kill himself. He gets so upset about this kid crying, and so he gets, so my son gets upset somehow, and start it like triggers this shit. But I see this is what I think though, man. I think that the school set that up because, see, unfortunately, my son has to take meds. Uh, I feel bad about that, but he's unstable. I'm, so I'm just being like, I'm telling you, I'm he, he has to. I have, have to do it, but I don't so know, he man. has to have it. It's fucked up. It's sad. It hurts me. It hurts me every day. But he acts better. He's normal now, and I'm like, wow. Oh man, because last year, like, I never knew what was wrong with him. He has, like, he's like super hyper. So I'm like, all right, now he's cool. But he still has his moments. But what I think is, because they know he's on this shit, I think they're playing games because I think they sent that kid over there so he say something and get all emotional and trigger something because they know what certain medicines do. And then but, but, say something, then listen, say something that he's going crazy. But listen, even a pharmacy, dude, that's what I'm saying. I look, I think. The school be in cahoots with the corporate pharmacy, like maybe CVS or Rite Aid or whatever you got in your state and town and city. You know what I'm saying? Uh, they, I think they're in cahoots. I was going to CVS. You know what I'm saying? I go somewhere else now, but I was going to CVS, right? I think the, the pharmacy people knew, and they and at first they gave me the right medicine the first couple times. Because it was working very you know well. Saying? Now as he's gradually starting to decline. And it's not because he's plateauing. It's because I know what y'all did. Y'all was giving him probably empty things. Sugar. sugar. Yeah, I'm putting sugar in them because they're capsules. You can shake them up and you can hear the shit. Right. Too bad Adderall is really like, Adderall is a stupid pharmaceutical for hyperactive kids and y'all some shots of, but Adderall is a methamphetamine, so basically it's crystal meth. It's and like it, it's, speed. Yeah, yeah, so man, if we would take it, if, a, if a, and a regular adult that doesn't have ADHD takes that, we're going to be bouncing off the walls. Like a ricocheting bullet, man, in an all metal room. Okay. So here's, so here's proof real quick. I'm not going to show you the thing, but he would come home last year with all of this bad on his calendar. Yeah. Now, this is good stuff. This, this is, is all, all good. This is all good. Probably like for, maybe one, three, four. Yeah, a sprinkle. Depend. Of a sprinkle of little. I'm, I was talking too much. Yeah. Yata, yata, yata. Yeah, it ain't nothing. But then this, this comes about and we're like. No, four was. No, four is I wasn't following directions. Okay, so that's that bullshit again. Yeah, yeah, what she probably told him to be talking. quiet, please be quiet, and he was talking, because yeah, if you look on there, she says yeah. talking a lot. So, but anyways, this year it's not that bad. However, so, we, they, they sent us a letter home that we had to sign, so the teacher could speak with the outside counselor person that we have, mm -hmm. for, that we got on our own, not the school. Yeah. Because dumb people they were trying to send us with, 
uh, turn yeah. the volume all the way up. Oh man. On the worst level. Oh man. So <laughs> we said we said we don't want your school stuff. That was last year. We said it again. We said it again. This year they sent papers home asking if we wanted to be uh involved in the SAP, which is Student Assistant Program, and we hit him with which the is outside wrong. help. We're like, no, we don't want nobody from your stupid school Fuck off. to call, to talk to Jason, um, our son, by themselves. Because obviously us. you guys knew it wasn't working the first time, so you want to stir up so, shit again. And I don't think in any, I'm just telling you to all the parents out there, don't ever allow them to sit with your child alone without you present yeah facts because they'll that's what they're going to twist turn and manipulate your kid all on a puppet string on a puppet string agenda 100 percent. i swear to god offer them a whole bunch of things like oh you get to play with the ipad today which is another dumb retarded device mm -hmm. that i see all kinds of kids just looking on all because their parents don't want to interact with them mm -hmm. in the right way yeah that's because now did i do that lazy. whenever i w had my uh son when he was little yeah, but I rarely let him play. You see, nowadays, nowadays, the parents want their kids to be calm in the store, so what do they handle? Oh. Their phone. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. When you see kids going, doo, 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 doo. they know how to operate a smartphone, but don't know how to operate a pencil and write one, two, three, eight. Blue Jay's confirming. I heard him say true, true on a phone, though. Good look, G. You ask a child They're gonna wit that, work. that, that knows how to do a smart. The street. Uh, Wash they know they all know how to turn it on, download an app, and all kind of stuff. But if it was for them to do uh, count to a hundred and write to one to a hundred, they can't do it. Yeah. Well, what we, we'll comes? We'll count by tens. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty. And they go up to ninety and a hundred, right? And then they saying uh, ninety-nine or something stupid after one hundred. It's like, man, are you going? Yeah. One ten, man. Just like last night, right? when I was trying to explain to him. Jay, it's a three-digit number. You know what he wrote? <laughs> one zero zero. Like, but he put it one zero zero. I'm like, Jay, that's not a three-digit number. He put it on a separate thing, so it was actually just the one, just the zero, just the zero, not one hundred. Mm. He did. I said, Jay. Yeah, yeah. Five three-digit numbers, yeah. like four hundred and five, Jay. Yeah, exactly any, 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 but this is what they do though, but this is what they do because like the screen, the screen, okay, you're staring at the screen, it's supposed to be a smartphone, it's dumbing you down because number one, when the flag it sucks the photons off your eyes and off your shots, and even when you're staring at it, it's still black, it just projects light from the other side. It's still a photon, and it also projects false light into you, which is also the LED mm -hmm. or LCD which liquid crystal get display. Gone off of it. You turn, Ooh, uh, like as soon as we turn a TV on or, or let him see any type of screen, he's like, zoom. Oh man! Eyeball bug eyed. Like I'm talking about like, 28 days later, like, I smell humans. I want to eat. Like, like what the hell, man? He's the hell there, he could be almost <laughs> asleep, and we say we're gonna turn a movie on, huh? Yeah. Really? Come out of a coma, he'd be about to go to bed. Oh, oh you'd off be his medicine. Pa yeah. Passed out almost on the couch, falling asleep, eyes closed. And I say something about, hey man, you want to watch a movie, man? Huh? Yeah, I'm awake. Whoa, creepy much. It's like robots, man. Yeah. You you, you turn the, their, their energy sucked down, but then. We keep getting off subject, it's crazy. Because we're trying to talk about the, how they trying to fuck with us now. We keep getting off. We do keep getting off subject, but we're on subject. You guys need to pay attention. To no, this. this isn't good. So this time around, somebody. We ain't got enough time. This thing, we about to wrap this up. There's like three minutes left. It's going to take too much. It's going to be way longer. So to, people are trying to mess with us again. now again. That's what we're, we're again. our point is. Go to the devil's word. Oh, I'm trying to set up another household. Motherfucker, you're not going to do it, yo. On my word. I love this woman. She loves me. She loves my son. Guess what? It's a family. We're going to be You're a not family, fucking breaking it and up. No one's fucking it up. Point blank. So if you want to come try to get that beef on, you can. I'm so welcome to it. Bring it, man. I like to eat meat anyway. I started eating meat again. I had to kick my vegan thing to the curb. You know what I'm saying? I had a little injury. You know what I'm saying? From way long time ago, car accident. Not way long time ago, but you know, a couple recent. I, 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 got, I got a car accident. I had to get adjusted. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But I'm getting back to normal. Oh, God. Now you guys are in trouble. So come no fuck with me if you want with, to. No one's messing with this household again. I'm tired of it. Yeah, because now I'm about to unleash the and lightning of Thor's hammer. I'm going to slam the hammer on the table. Would you think I still ain't playing with it? Yeah, I am. 
Don't be foolish. It's right here still. He has all his stuff. It's still right here. Please don't get your head bashed in. Please don't get your head beat in. Oh my God, volumes. Oh my God, the diseases that you fools are riddled with. You zombies and trolls and know I'm talking to. Whack, 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 whack. Hydrocarbon retards. Your agenda will be fucking melted. Because guess what? I come to bring the light and the fire and my torch and electricity and my hammer. And guess what? Water's just nothing more than a conductor. Peace. You know what town it is. That's right. Yeah, hit him with it. <laughs> I heard you.